Epic Quest Director. I, I really was introduced and really started pondering that and taking it to the Lord by uh, a guy in our church in Kentucky uh, who gave me the book by Lauren Cunningham, Is That Really You, God? And it uh, just kind of hit me hard, and but I also knew it wasn't time yet. And so it was probably about three or four years later uh, before I went into YWAM. But uh, that was, really, it, it gave me insight and and the realization that, hey, I could do this. And and beyond that, a sense of God calling me to. And I'd always had a, a love and a desire to, to work with young people and see them become all God created them to be. And I saw Youth with a Mission as a, a great vehicle mm -hmm. to be able to accomplish that. I, mean, I, I can think of a lot of different ones. Uh, I mean, I think of the kid in... Uh, well, kid, I call him a kid. I just got a, an email from him yesterday. They've had their first or their second child now, mm -hmm. uh, but Andre, uh, who mm -hmm. lives in Finland, and uh, the fact that he, you know, he's from Belarus. First met him when he was 12. Now he and his wife uh, live in Finland, are working uh, the Youth of the Mission program, Mission Adventures up there, doing tremendous things with that, and taking young people into Russia up in the Arctic region, mm -hmm. and uh, so it's exciting to see him you know, where he's at now in comparison to where he was when he was 12 years old and running the streets and yeah. doing different things. And, yeah. But uh, it, it's neat to see. Plus, there's another guy up there with him, uh, Sasha. And uh, Sasha is a kid that Andre used to basically drag off the streets to uh, to go to church with him, go to the King's Kids program that was going on at his church. And Sasha didn't want to go necessarily. Uh, actually, most of the time he didn't want to go at all. But uh, Andre you know, no, you're going with me, mm. and uh, and since that time, I mean, God grabbed Sasha's heart, and Sasha's working up there now mm. uh, in Finland, uh, working alongside Andre and Mari, and uh, and a real assistant, uh, you know, assisting them in a big way, and you know, leading outreaches himself uh, mm. last winter, uh, leading outreaches to, into Russia. So. Well, be leading that as far as the most part for the Epic Quest portion of that. We'll also be involved with uh, Mission Adventures uh, a few times uh, when we'll have some joint sessions together. But for the most time, uh, be directing that and leading that. Basically, working with our interns who are coming in as well as our regular staff. And we'll all put on our official EQ hat and make sure the other hats are put away as much as possible. Uh, during that two-week training time, getting ready for the kids to come in as the summer starts, mm -hmm. and uh, and then being involved also with the teen leadership training time, which is a, a three-day program before the first outreach, where we invite our our older teens uh, that come in, and we help prepare them for the outreach itself mm -hmm. and their leadership responsibilities, trying to give them more direct mentorship. Mm -hmm. This summer, I've got the, the directing Epic Quest, but then releasing that outreach to the Baltic but then staying involved as far as with Panama and then the Panama Baseball Outreach.